At the beginning of the pandemic, every college sport in the country was put on hold, including the ASU women's soccer team. Say, okay, like, in case we do have a season, like, we need to be ready. Like, we, everyone needs to be, like, doing their own stuff at home, kind of, like, making sure you're somewhat in shape, like, with whatever you can at home, and then just be ready to come in. Although the coaches were optimistic about having a season, it was hard to know what was going to happen. After traveling back to her home country, Brazil, Lara Barbieri was told by her coach that it was uncertain when she was going to be able to come back to the United States. And he kept saying, like, this season is going to happen, this season is going to happen, but we don't know the date, so you guys should be here, you guys should be here. But, like, for me, I was not able to get in. On August 10th, the Pac-12 announced that all fall sports would be postponed until 2021, including women's soccer. Instead of playing their season in the fall, they would continue to practice and train until the spring. Everyone was coming in and no one was fit, so it was like kind of a good thing. Like, oh, like we'll have time to get fit now because people haven't had like weights or been able to work out as much as other people. But then it was also like, oh my God, we're not going to have a season. Like, I don't know, it was really sad because like everyone was looking forward to having a season, especially during COVID. Just like it's like one of the things you're looking forward to, you know, is like being able to be back out there and play. The Pac-12 and the Big Ten were the only two Power Five conferences that decided to postpone all fall sports until 2021 until recently deciding to bring football back for the end of this season. But the SEC, ACC and Big 12 all continued with fall sports. I think NCAA should just like have a, a national rule, like no conference will be playing or every conference should be playing. The ASU soccer team admits that it is hard to watch other teams compete while they are only allowed to practice. It just feels like we're just, you know, it's repeating over and over again. Like, and games are like the one thing that I think I look forward to. Like, oh my God, it's game week. Like, you know, it gets me excited, it gets me pumped. But like, now that I don't have that, it's just like, oh, we have practice. Like, you know, it's like a different <laughs> feeling. The Sun Devils continue to practice in hopes that they will have a season in the spring. I'm getting super overwhelmed because I basically don't know when I when I will be able to come back and what's going to happen with our season. The NCAA will allow conferences that did not compete in the fall to start on February 3rd, and the NCAA tournament selection will be on April 18th. Aaron Slindy, MCO 502, Tempe.